Hey everybody, Andrew Castro here, and we're looking at the Enigma from Dismania. If you're looking for that controllable distance driver, this could be the disc for you. everyone it's Andrew Castro and we're looking at the all-new Enigma from Dismania this is their brand new distance driver in their evolution line series it's a distance driver 12 speed came out in this brand new neo plastic that we saw previously so let's take a look at this thing and see what it can do uh, first things I noticed when getting this in my hand is the plastic feel uh, this is in that neo plastic so we saw this previously um, this plastic just feels really good. The ones that I received as far as uh, profile goes, they're not too domey, they're not super flat. They feel nice. Um, it is a 12-speed driver, so you know the rim is a little bit wide. It does have a pretty good feel for a wide rim driver. Uh, I see these numbers on it and I typically think of like something like a DDX where um, I wasn't too much of a fan of it. Uh, the DDX just felt really shallow in my hand, but this disc compared to that, uh, this feels a little bit deeper, so it feels more comfortable in my hand than like a DDX does. Um, so yeah, this stuff feels great. Um, when getting out there and throwing them, it was really nice throwing this disc. Um, I felt like I didn't have to work as hard um, to get distance with these, which was really nice. And I feel like I didn't have to finesse the disc as much as I normally would if I was trying to throw like a DDX. So this was a really... A uh, nice change up for me given that I don't throw too many 12 speeds So when getting out there and throwing them on a hyzer um, I was probably getting these around that 350 360 foot mark roughly and it was just really nice throwing these uh, They held the hyzer line pretty nice uh, They kind of flipped up and rode a little bit straight for me and finished a little bit more straighter uh, You can get the exaggerated hyzer if that's what you're looking to do, you just give that a more of an angle. But these were nice on a hyzer. Just go out there, flip up, and finish uh, right kind of back center of where I was throwing. Um, I really enjoyed these throwing these flat to like that kind of semi anhyzer flattish type of release. I felt like this is where the disc excelled for me given my arm speed and everything. I got really good distance on this for me. So when throwing this flat, uh, they just kind of flipped out there a little straight kind of turning over just a little bit and then came back um, and finished out really nice and straight a lot of distance that typically I don't get to I'd say you know around that 380 to 400 foot mark when throwing these on a flat or slightly Anheuser release so that was really enjoyable when throwing these on an Anheuser release um, it was really nice to kind of see these flex a little bit more um, I typically wouldn't use a driver like this to try to execute like big huge turnover shots I don't have the arm for that I have other discs that I use for that so when throwing these I'm throwing these with more of a flex to kind of get like a nice S line to them um, I was getting around that 390 uh, to 400 foot mark getting these out there you'd see them kind of turn a little bit over to the right and then get straight and then fade back out if I was punching on them a little bit harder um, it seemed to kind of like finish a little bit more to the right but nothing crazy like you would expect for maybe like your DDX or if you're using a disc that's similar um, to that as well. I did get a little uh, bit of throws with this uh, sidearm. I'm not a big sidearm thrower so um, I typically will throw something a little bit more overstable than this. It was really easy distance just you know when on a little hyzer getting out there around like 320 roughly and when getting on it a little bit more um, I could see it kind of flip up and right out over to the left for me and then kind of finish back out over to the right. So I could see how this could be a great kind of like flip up to flat uh, and like really nice straight shot for distance if that's what you're looking for in a sidearm disc. So really kind of like a nice straight um, distance driver I feel that offers a lot of control whether backhand or sidearm. But yeah guys, overall I enjoyed throwing this disc. It was a lot of fun. I'll probably keep tinkering with it. Um, I have a DD3 in my bag, so this kind of complements nicely with that. All new Enigma from Dismania in the Neo Plastic. Sick disc, a lot of fun out there throwing, but if you get a chance, go ahead and pick one up. Check out some of the other stuff from the Evolution line, but Enigma guys, get on out there and check them out. 
Hope you get out there and play some disc golf, and I'll catch you later. Bye.